All right, last time we learned how to play hot cross buns on your trombone. Today we're gonna learn what that looks like when we read the music on the staff. So if you've got your book, I'd like you to open it up to page six and find number 17. All right, if we're on page six and looking at number 17, this is what it looks like when we look in your book. So our first note of hot cross buns is D in fourth position, where we line up the end of the slide here with the bell. Okay, fourth position D, and that looks like this. It's on the third line of the bass clef staff. Our next note in sixth position where we reach almost all the way out is C. C is on the second space from the bottom on the bass clef staff. Our last note of hot cross buns is B flat in first position. So we've got it all the way in and B flat looks like this. It's got that tiny little B in front of it and it's on the second line. Now each one of these notes gets two counts because they are half notes. Half notes are not filled in and they have a stem on them. So we're gonna do two counts, two counts, two counts, and then we have two counts of rest. And we're gonna repeat and do the same thing here. Then it changes a little bit. This note is on the same line as this B flat. They are both B flats and they're gonna be played in first position. This one is filled in in the center, which means it's a quarter note and we'll only get one count. So we're gonna play four B flats all the way through and each one is going to get one count. Then we're going to change to a letter C and it's just like this C, but it's filled in and it's gonna get one count each. So we'll play four quarter note Cs and then we're gonna play just like we did at the beginning to finish it off two counts each. Go ahead and pause and try that on your own. And when you're ready to move on to the next step, go ahead and hit play. All right, now that we've mastered hot cross buns on your trombone, it's time to learn another song. So if you're looking in your book, we're gonna go up to the top of the page on page six and find number 14, Rolling Along. To do this song, we're gonna to have to learn a new note. This is the first new note that we have. This note is called F. F is in first position, just like B flat, but it's gonna be higher. Here's what F sounds like. Go ahead and pause and try playing F a couple of times. When you're ready to move on, go ahead and click play and we're gonna play through this whole song. All right, we are ready to play this whole song. So you know all four notes that it takes to play rolling along. I'm gonna play it for you so you can hear what it sounds like and then you're gonna get a chance to play it on your own. Each note in this song gets one count each because they are all quarter note notes or quarter note rests. One, two, ready, go. for next time is to record yourself playing hot cross buns and upload it to lesson number 2.3 and then record yourself playing rolling along number 14 and upload it to lesson 2.3. These are due the next time that we have class and you have the rest of the class to work on this assignment. If you have any questions, please let me know. Happy playing!